morning, FCC. It's great to have you with us. Carly is off on her honeymoon, so you're stuck with me again. <laughs> and for those of you who are just visiting, I'd like to extend an extra warm welcome. My name's Trisha, and I've got a few things to help keep you in the know. First up is the oldie but goodie stuff. So check out the program that you were given on your way in and our website, FCCUnion.org, to get more complete picture of what's going on around here. Also, you were given a connection card along with your program. Do us a favor and fill that out somewhere between here and the end of service. We'll pick them up in a bit here. I guess that just about wraps up the standard things. Speaking of being all wrapped up, say hello to our newest bundle of joy, Viviana. Isn't God good? All right, it's a new year with high hopes. So how do you get the year started off right? Are you ready to get started? If you're somewhat new around here and have a few questions, we'd like to invite you to our Get Started class. We'll be offering our Get Started class Tuesday, January 29th at 6.30 p.m. This is our membership class and will help give you a better understanding of what happens around here, how you can partner with us, and help you decide if you need to call FCC home. Sign up at the connection point today. Yes! We're so excited to be hosting and offering something just for married couples. It's called The Art of Marriage, and we'll be hosting this event on February 8th and 9th. It's time to look at relationships in a whole new way. What would your life be like if your marriage was stronger? Whether you're on the verge of divorce or in a healthy marriage, we can all grow in our relationships. The Art of Marriage is a two-day video-driven conference taken directly from Family Life's Weekend to Remember. It will help you apply what the Bible teaches in a powerful way. Join us as we try to help make families and marriages stronger by rediscovering the art of marriage. For cost and more info, be sure to check out the connection point. It's true, most Christians are not in danger of ruining their lives. They're in danger of wasting them. Are you unsatisfied with the kind of Christian life you've settled for? Today, we'll join lead Pastor David as he leads us into our new series, Great Things. We'll come to the life-altering understanding that God is ready to accomplish a greatness in your life that is entirely out of human reach. But it's exactly what God has seen in you all along. 